Hi, my name is Paul Russell. I am a senior applications engineer at Akuma America. Today I'm going to be going over the automatic pallet change recovery procedure on an MA600 horizontal machining center. So an automatic pallet recovery on an Akuma is very easy to do. A situation where you may encounter this is when you have a power failure or if the operator hits the reset button while the machine is trying to index the APC or automatic pallet changer or uh, you may hit, the operator may hit the e-stop button as well. So I'm going to simulate a uh, interruption in the automatic pallet changer sequence by hitting the e-stop as it's moving. In order to get the APC running, we give it an M60, an MDI, and cycle start. And for whatever reason, the machine's gonna stop, or we're gonna force it to stop. I'll hit the e-stop, and it drifts to a stop. We can see our alarm on the screen. So in order to clear this, we need to pull the e-stop button and turn the power back on. And to get to the recovery procedure, we need to be in manual mode. And then we hit the machine operation button. On here, we have an APC operation screen where we can see our sequence numbers. Normally, we wanna be at either sequence number one, if pallet one is in the machine, or sequence number 11 when pallet number two is in the machine. I'm gonna hit the one step return. We could go advance or return cycle start. I generally like to return from where it came from. So I'll press the button and we'll count down back to sequence number one. Every sequence needs to be initiated with the one step return button. And we're down at sequence number three and now we're back at number one and we have a start OK indicator on the screen. So now we are back to a normal running situation. And that's how you recover from an APC error.